Did you really walk through a window at Sarah Silverman's house? Yeah. Were you, were you high or drunk? You want me to tell you that story? I'd love that. I'd love it. I went to Sarah Silverman's house for a party a couple of weeks ago. I wasn't invited. I went with other people. And um, someone offered me some chocolate. In England, chocolate is normally chocolate. Uh-oh. In California, doesn't necessarily mean that chocolate right. is simply chocolate. And oh. it was in a wrapper, like a Hershey-style wrapper. It wasn't Hershey's, I should make that clear, but it was in that kind <laughs> of wrapper. Okay. It looked very official. Um, I consumed some of this chocolate. It turned out it wasn't just chocolate. There was mm. something recreational. Yes, yes. I um, I lasted about 30 seconds. I went into a hole from which I couldn't crawl out. Just a dark kind of, the world just Whoa, enveloped me. man. Vroom, like within seconds, I had a little lie down for a while at the party. Um, one of my great concerns is like, is, is embarrassing myself in front of a big room of comedians. Well, because, yeah. You know, comedians don't let you forget. <laughs> that will be there forever. And, uh, and uh, for a while there, the, the lying down didn't help. So I went in the bathroom and I stared at myself in the mirror. That didn't help. That doesn't. That, no, never, that, that just makes things bad. worse. <laughs> yeah. It's almost as bad as the guy in Poltergeist that stared in the mirror oh, yeah. right. for a while and started picking his face apart. Right. Well, then I came back out into the party. I thought I'd get a breath of fresh air and mm. I headed for the outside area. But the route that I took led me straight through an eight foot plate glass window, which shattered no. in its entirety. Um, just crashed around me. Um, I was, I had like a minor graze on my hand, a little graze on my head, otherwise miraculously fine. I'm not quite sure why. I think maybe because my feet are so big, <laughs> they extend so far from my body. I oh. feel like they make contact oh, yeah. with it first. first. It's smashed and then my body arrives. And then you went through. Yes. Perfect. It's like a stunt. Um, and I sort of blearily kind of turned back and, and stared. And the person I remember staring vividly back at me was Jeff Ross. The ah. one person you don't want yeah, to see yeah, you do yeah, something yeah. like that. Roastmaster. Right. The Roastmaster General. He's yes. unpleasant to look at under the best of circumstances, <laughs> much less when you're standing there in blood and broken glass. Yeah. But what's extraordinary is uh, I looked at a picture after the event, and the glass was not even transparent. It was a dark brown color. It was. It, so oh where were you God. going? I was, I mean, wow. man alive. It was, it was, it was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Well, you was embarrassed? It? I wasn't even, it, uh, not only the next day. Mm. Th th at that moment, I didn't know what to do. I had no sense of what. you just go what. like, oh, that's not a door. Yeah, I just, I just had a, no, oh. I couldn't compute like what you do after that. Yeah, but what was yeah, in the yeah. chocolate? <laughs> ha, did you figure it out? Was it hash? Probably was it hot? It was hash, but I thought you guys think it was hash, right? More, Probably hash. More wild than that. It seemed very Maybe You hate to think you'd do that just on hash. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, it better have been fucking LSD. <laughs> exactly. Maybe a little Molly <laughs> action in there. Oh, uh, maybe, huh? Some Mollies. I sent Sarah an email the next day that said, thank Thanks for a great party. I had a lot of fun. By the way, I don't know if you noticed, but I walked through a glass window. <laughs> I was my big fear was that she was going to charge me for it. Oh yeah. man! But she Did said she? it was insured. <laughs>